Wait. Damn, bam. Oh shit, no. I need the yeah. fucking Marguerite and your bullshit. Okay, well, you're all dead. Took a little bit of damage. So this doll was in the first game. Is this? Um, Ethan, Mia. Is this Mia? I guess this could be Evie before she turned 105. Yeah, there's uh, there's Mia and Evie. I love this. Not much change. She just plays with her dolls all day. Turned two guys molded today. Um. Ch -ch 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 -ch. After playing balls or dad, she started complaining about being tired. Turned one guy into a fat molded. Health bad. Mental state stressed. Uh, Might have CT secretion high. Other. Sudden aging. She's aging all of a sudden, losing weight, her hair is falling out the works. The more she screams, the more she vomits. Basement's fully contaminated. No parent calls for aging. Gonna ask for further instructions. Health weak but stable. Mental state delusional incoherent. Mito C T uh Mito my C T uh stable. Aging is slowed, seems pretty stable. Got to eat necrotoxin from the company. Use it if she gets weird, and I thought I was the funny one, so that must have been for Lucas. Yes! I want like a million of those bullets, because I need them. So this is where they kept Evelyn, which is kind of fucking sad. I can't read this bulletin. So, there was a few things in here, but... But just that, like, that's all that was in here. I guess, because I know that this isn't where we need to be, so... I am sorry, Evie. Like, that was... Wow, and there's these lasers that would probably have chopped her up to bits. The weird part is that she wasn't even here, like, when she broke out, you know? Like, she was on a fucking tanker in the mid-Atlantic. Bam. I want to make sure I had the right bolts equipped. Huh. Ah, fucking turrets. Take those. I killed, wait, what? I killed off all the connection researchers. They were poking around where they weren't supposed to when I wasn't looking, but I knew exactly what they were up to. Probably didn't like having to report to me. So I threw them in a cage or something. They shut their pants and their lives. I'm just worried I won't be able to hold back from laughing when I make the report that they meant. Wow. So. So Lucas had his own thing going, like. Oh, that's a fucking save point. Lockpick? Can I go back and get. Where's the lockpick? Save point. about going to get that lockpick. Excuse me. It's just down here.
right? Here it is. There it is. Thank Christ. I almost shit myself right there. Fucking turret. Wait, what? Oh. That's kind of anticlimactic. And why did that not activate earlier? Oh, probably because it was crouched. I'm not gonna lie, that that was kinda kinda anticlimactic to, to get that. I'm just kind of excited for something that was in that. Where are we going? Oh. This one. Why can't why can't I check what's in this, huh? Just saying. Excuse me. I can't get it from this angle again. Wait, what? Thank you. I will take that shit for days. We'll go down. Oh shit. got your emails. We know you're funneling info to someone. That's none of your goddamn business, Chris. A lot of people out there want to know about our little AV. A lot of people. Your friends the Connections know about this? They don't strike me as the forgiving type. That's my business. You let me worry about them. You're about to have your hands full. Oh, God. I've been given way too much shit. This is this is the easy one. Oh fuck you, dude! Shut up! Oh. I can't. I I don't. No. I don't believe it. But I sh believe it. It's over. No, he's talking no. after I shot him in the head, right? No way. Just shut up and accept it, Lucas. Love that, wouldn't you? Oh boy. So this is for a few Jack. We've got a situation down here. <laughs> the infection is at critical mass. Tell me something I don't know. Oh, I've got something for you. You're a fucking squirrel. You're going to need to proceed with caution. Extreme caution. Oh, well, that's different. Like it haven't been since we got here. Monster. Still loading in the new scene. Like, uh, hey. Oh, fuck me. No. No, one 
one sec. <laughs> okay, and we're back. I needed just just a second to deal with something in a three to one chairs. Uh, take a bite of food, which is what I needed to deal with, by the way. Oh, the putts. Like, I know my whole recording so far has had, like, all the breaks that I've taken, but we're, like, at 2 minutes 15, or 2 hours 15 minutes. Oh, God. Uh, this. Hi, Lucas. Oh, God. Wait, did that do something? Fuck. Fuck. Get up, Chris. Actually, do I have 140 shotgun shells? I need oh god, I'm about to die. I need to be better about this. I have to I have to. are refilled. Where are you? Fuck me. Shit. I think I'm okay for one more hit. Shit. I also need to be paid attention. As I'm whining, come on, like, I was fine, and then he did more, and then I wasn't fine. Three, two, one, eat food. Eat food if you've been drinking with me, goddamn. Hi there, corrosive. Wait, what? Oh shit, I'm way back here. No, no, I'm not. Come in here. Okay, that doesn't seem to be anything. You know what? We're actually going to make this a bit of a learning lesson. I'm going to try something. Do it. Oh, okay. So that does work.
Climatic. I think I won. Yeah, it's the first full cutscene I've had since the beginning of the game. Game over. Oh! Jesus Christ, dude. Didn't we need him alive? <laughs> How do I stop it? You need to find a way to shut down the server. There may be some transformer relays you can... Nice. Okay, that worked. Gonna be some pissed computer techs up here, but... Run your river. What's the sit rep? The facility is clear. Even the newer breeds have been neutralized. <sighs> That's not Chris. Then I'm out of here. I don't know who the hell that is, but it ain't Chris. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, we feel bad for Jack and his family. For anybody other than Lucas. Good. Lucas was a piece of shit. Jack and Zoe and everybody else. Think we did any good here? No, I don't think I don't think so. But the mold is contained. Hopefully they're Evie's last victims. Hopefully. All right, I'm on my way. The only person, the only person it's okay to be is Claire. And that's it. That's the only person I wanted to be. So, well, that's the end of the game. God, these things are moving super fast. Which is really weird for a Japanese game. Oh, well, that's the end of that, I guess. <laughs> Yeah, two hours. Admittedly, there's there's big chunks of that where I was just kind of sitting here. Eleven restarts. Oh, the vast majority of them I took on my own because uh, it was like, no, I want to do. This. Oh, eight of nine files. Um, I only deflected attacks at the very last mission. <laughs> uh, seven to ten NT coins. Okay. And I think. I think the other mode is professional. Like, um, you can get a you get a trophy for just doing this. Continue. The hell is continue? Okay, game. Whenever you feel like fucking loading up, like. We haven't had this issue forever. Holy shit. It's just not wanting to do anything. Like. Okay. Wait, what? Oh, this is my last, like, save point. No, I'm good. Um, that was really intense. Like, but not, like, scary. Just action-y intense. That's a bit weird to say, but it is what it is. Like, there's not a whole lot that scared me. That's not Chris Redfield. I don't give a shit what anybody says. I'm waiting for the story to come around and say, like, this is a, a fucking clone. Because I don't know what a... You know what? We're gonna look it up. 
horses. Uh, Why would it not go? Okay, apparently these are real things. I like that I type in TNC Resident Evil and automatically the very first search on Google is Umbrella Biohazard Countermeasure Service. We're looking this fucking shit up. Uh. Oh god, there's a whole lot of there's a whole lot of shit here. No, nope, yep, I'm, oh my god, it goes on for like. We're not doing that. Okay, so that's... It's like a private military contract or something like that? I'm not sure how I feel about this. Because I'm, I'm so conflicted with the fact that this dude... This whoever the fuck he is is supposed to be Chris. Who's supposed to be a square-jawed, black-haired uh, military stud. And, and it has nothing to do against this guy, but this guy ain't Chris, you know? Like, that's not who he is. Which is fine, there's nothing wrong with that, and that ain't who he is. Um... That was intense, and, uh, to be honest, for a free game, that can't- God, I can't stop thinking of me. Hold on. Where's my water? There it is. Sorry, I couldn't, like, god damn it. I just, I can't win right now. Like, here we go. What I'm meaning to say is, the big issue I had at the end of RE7, like, and it wasn't story-based so much, it's just kind of like that didn't make any sense, was what happened to Lucas? Because... His birthday party room. We had the birthday party with uh, Clancy, I think, is the one, one of Clancy's team members. Um, and you learn how to do it from there, and then because you can only, I mean, you can only move forward if you do it right. So um, th that videotape gives you the ability to learn the right way, and then you can do it the right way the first time. Not that I did. I may have. I can't remember. Um, but. You blow up his birthday party room. You get up to his little, uh, his little peak, if you will, and uh, he's gone. He's taken off, and then you never see him again. And I remember I was drunk, and I thought when we were fighting Jack in his monster stage, I thought that was Lucas, and so I just kind of blanked out from there and thought it. But as I look back on my videos from my review, I'm like, oh god, that wasn't that wasn't Lucas at all. That was fucking Jack. So there was a big thing like, what the fuck happened to Lucas? And I'm still, there's still a, a bit of questioning for me, because I don't, like, was he just a psycho, or was he just a piece of shit, like, because he's the only one in his family who went, who went crazy non-psychotically, you know, like, the, the rest of his family, his mom and his dad, were infected by the Mida might you see or whatever. Uh, excuse me, holy shit. Whereas, Zoe, as far as we could tell, was infected but never, never influenced, I guess is the right word. Like, like the last we saw of her, we were dealing with her and Mia, and she was like, give my dad the dose. And I'm like, oh, I give your dad the dose. And then we only had one dose. And I'm like, well, I'm gonna give the dose to my wife. And, off this stranger I met six minutes ago. Um, and that's the last we saw of her, so I'm assuming there's more to it. And I, I do know that, um, because it says it as soon as you pop up into it. Actually, we'll go, we'll go look it up right now. When you go to, uh, Zoe must, uh, did Zoe must end? Zoe must die? End of Zoe. It's like weeks after Not a Hero, and I try not to read any more of it, but you can't help but read that first. And yeah, and so you read it, it's like Jack's brother, Joe, and you're like, oh. And you read it, it's like, must face this danger with his bare fist, and you're like, um. What? 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 
what's happening here? And and I'm assuming this is when Zoe and you look at Zoe right there, and you're just like, but you look at Jack or a uh, Joe Baker, and you're like, what the hell is happening here? Like, is she crystallizing? Like, is she turning into a a uh, 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 fucking molded? Like, it looks so weird. Like, I don't understand what's going on. We will get into that, though. We're going to get into that next, actually, but not tonight. So, uh, three to one cheers. Again, this is Dominic with Silver Screen Reviews. And thank you for watching these and the, or this and these episodes of Resident Evil 7 Biohazard um, Expansion DLC added content, whatever you want to call it. Uh, not a Hero, starring Chris Redfield, a.k.a. the not-real Chris Redfield. That's all I'm saying. If you guys enjoyed these episodes, leave a like down below. Let me know you appreciate the content, you want more of it, all the good jazz, comments, criticism, and suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. I love hearing from you guys. Otherwise, have a good night, and I will see you in the next part.